guys, Wendy here. It's DIY time again at Draw So Cute and today we're going to be making this 2018 calendar. So let's get started. To make this 2018 mini calendar, go to my website at drawsecute.com and print out these two sheets of artwork that I've provided for you for free. So the first one is basically just the calendar sheets and you can print this out on regular paper. The second one is the mini um, calendar stand. This one, if you can, print it out on stock paper just so that the stand can stand, <laughs> can stand up a little bit better when you put the sheets on top. And even better if you have um, color stock paper, that way your stand can have different colors. But if you don't have color stock paper um, and you want color, just cut out this rectangle right here and flip it over and color the back of it for whatever color you want. The first part I'm going to show you is to how to make this stand. So I'm going to use the white one only because you can see the lines a little bit better when I explain it. But I will also show you the color one just so you can see the difference when you put the calendar sheets on top. The first step to making this stand is to cut out this rectangle. So I'm just going to go roughly cut all the way around it so that my paper is just a lot easier, smaller and easier for me to hold. So once you've cut all around it, the second step is to basically cut this T solid line right here. So I'm just going to go in with my scissors. And so it's really easy if you just put your scissors right against the line, nice and straight, and just take a snip down. And then what you want to do the next step is to come in here and cut this line right here. So I'm just going to navigate my scissors in here and cut that solid line. Snip it right straight across to the dotted line and the same thing on this side. So then let's do the uh, same thing to the other side. Straight in, one clean snip, and then once again, right across to the dotted line. So from there, you basically just want to fold at this dotted line. So just come in here, and take your paper and just fold. And so it's gonna be easy to fold because um, you've snipped right directly at this dotted line. So it should be nice and even on both sides. And you just wanna make sure when you do fold down that this part right here is aligned to this bottom part so that it's nice and straight across. So after you've lined it up, just go ahead and fold at that crease right there. So then the same thing on the other side. Make sure it's nice and aligned and fold down. There. So you have this nice little legs now right here and a base. So from there, I've given you this little mark right here and this is basically where you want to um, glue. So I'm gonna take this sheet right here so that I don't dirty my table. And I'm just gonna get some um, glue stick or whatever glue you have and I'm just going to put some glue right here at this bar right here that I've given you. So just be very generous with the glue. Oops. And from there just go ahead and pinch it together. So just align it, align the tops and pinch. And just hold it for a few seconds just to make sure that it won't come apart. And that's it. <laughs> very, very simple little stand. The next step is to color and cut out these seven calendar sheets. Once you're done, it should look something like this. So seven little cards right here, all colored in. And so then the next step is to basically just fold them in half. So I'm just gonna take, I'm just gonna start with this one and I'm just gonna go ahead and fold all of them. So once you're done folding your calendar sheets, get your stand and we're basically going to pile the calendar sheets on here. And we want to start with the last one, which is going to be your special dates and notes. So oops. <laughs> and I'm sorry because my camera's up here, so I'm going to have to hold it like this to show you. And so then the next one is going to be um, November, December. So November will be right in front. 
and then it's going to be <laughs> October. <laughs> okay, then it's going to be September. I hope I didn't get this wrong. <laughs> September and then October. Then it's going to be, let's see here, July and August. <laughs> and then it's going to be um, May, June. And then March, April. And then, ta-da, the last one, January, February. Okay, so let me see if I got this right. <laughs> Ready, here we go. So January, then when it's February, all you have to do is turn your stand around on your table. And you just put it right underneath. And then it's gonna be March, April. Just to make it easier, I'm gonna remove it. <laughs> okay, then it's gonna April, and then it's gonna be May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December, <laughs> and then the last one, which is your special dates and notes. So I did get it right. So I'm just gonna go ahead and repile it back up. There, my 2018 calendar all done. I wanted to also let you know that this little stand right here can double as a pen holder. So in this little nook right here, you can just stick your pen in right here and it holds it nice and steady. So thank you for all the requests you gave me to make a 2018 calendar and I hope you love this one just as much as the 2017 calendar I made for you. So now it's time to say goodbye to 2017 and hello 2018. Happy New Year, Draw So Cute fans and let me know in the comments below which one is your favorite month that I've made for you this year and I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.